Australian authorities are planning to evacuate thousands more people from flood-affected suburbs in Sydney's west, which is set for its worst flooding in 60 years, with another day of drenching rain expected. Unrelenting rains over the past three days have swelled rivers in Australia's most populous state of New South Wales. This has caused widespread damage and triggered calls for mass evacuations. Nearly 3,000 people have already been evacuated from the low-lying areas. Large parts of the country's east coast will get hit by more heavy rains from Monday due to the combination of a tropical, a tropical low over northern western Australia. Uh, so far, the SES has been called out at least 8,000 times. Uh, there are around 15,000 people who've been evacuated from the mid-north coast from their homes. In the Nepi and Richmond uh, uh, Valley region or Hawkesbury region, there have been about 3,000 evacuations to date. Uh, 19 evacuation orders have been issued and potentially more to come. 34 areas uh, or 30, up to 38 areas uh, have already been uh, regarded as disaster, natural disaster areas, which means people in those communities and local government in those communities can get assistance. That means up to $1,000 each for adults and $400 for children. And uh, we thank the Commonwealth Government for working with the state government and making that available. Uh, the situation is evolving. The heavy rainfalls are going to continue. And uh, we, are, we, are, we are now seeing alerts issued for weather warnings for the Illawarra and South Coast. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.